Well, hello, it's Nancy today. I am in the doctor's office and she's left me alone with this lovely machine which will decide what my blood pressure is. Oh my gosh, it squeezes so hard. Oh, oh, it's like labor. And you're not supposed to get tense, right? That's the idea of getting your blood pressure taken. You're supposed to be relaxed. Ah. Well, I'm here because I got this cold and my stuff on my nose was clear and from my throat on my chest it's yellow. And I have a tendency to get bronchitis. If you don't treat bronchitis, it becomes pneumonia. So there are numbers there. Can't read it. This is a 151. Is that right? I can't be right. Oh no, 121 over 82. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so, so I came in because, yeah, bronchitis turns into pneumonia if you don't treat it. And once you have pneumonia, you always get pneumonia. It's really bad for your body water in your lungs, I guess. Anyway, so I'm coming here and maybe, maybe it'll get, um, what I really need is when I cough, it, it, I, I cough so hard that every nerve ending in my skin fires and it's so painful on my entire body. And so I would like to have some codeine cough syrup or even just Tylenol 3 so that I can suppress the cough. Codeine is the only thing that is known to suppress cough. Everything else just patches it up on your throat or something. Oh my gosh, it's so hard. Oh man. She must have it folded over my skin or something. They have this television out there and on it they've got all the, the risks to children and it's the dust in your house is toxic because it's from the breaking down of the fabrics and things in your furniture. Oh. What is it this time? 133 over 85. Ah, it's going up. Let's see if I can adjust this a little bit so it doesn't push me so much. Oh, anyway, um, and so they were talking about all these chemicals in your home. And you know, not cleaning with chemicals. Well, I don't clean anyway, so that's not a problem. But it says about about dust and that you should really vacuum the dust. But a, you, a, a dry dust thing doesn't do it. It just pushes it around. It's interesting. And if you have babies crawling on the floor and if they chew on plastic toys, the plastic gets into them. The plastic from your, if you put your food in plastic, you know, a lot of things you buy with food are plastic now. There's a few things that are glass. I'm glad they're back to glass. Anyway, this is going to get tight, so I'm just going to relax and breathe. But you shouldn't paint when you're pregnant. You shouldn't do anything like that. And before 1990, there was paint, lead in all the paint.
All right, what is it this time? 121 over 75. Hi, everything's good.